Well, good morning, everyone. We're just up here on the roof. Oh, there goes the generator. Well, okay, so that's one thing I have to look at. Uh, yes, where did we leave off? I believe where we left off is I wasn't sure what the plan was for today. It was basically going to be driven by perhaps if somebody attacked me or something like that. And it doesn't look like anybody's coming. So, well, at least not at this exact moment. Yeah, I had to start right away because uh, I did run the last episode. If you remember correctly, there was a lock crate over on the shoreline and I had to go get it. So there, the first thing we need to do is to get our uh, lock pick going. So I need, oh, that's exactly how many, I think I needed four boards. Oh, and I've got scrap, I've got stuff on me. All right, let's take a look at the situation. I think we're, Ooh. I need more uh, mass. Oh no, there goes the mass. And come on, it says 75, you could do it. Trust me, here, how about if I did this? 75, this says 75. Oh, now it's going to pick it up. All right, there you go. And I should probably... Oh, yeah. Oh, let's do that right now. <laughs> All right, what's the power at? 11. And is my fridge still running? <laughs> I believe it is. It's got little frosty bits around the outside. And it says turn off, so that, that means it's on. Well, there we go. So that was kind of cool. How are we doing on the... F you know, that's what happens, I guess, when, when uh, things get really busy and I just sort of start losing track of stuff. Um, all right. I guess, yeah, let's put away some bits and pieces. Oh, I've got SVT rounds. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, we're almost back up to the point where I can start using the SVT again. That would be actually kind of nice. So what do we got? We've got weapons pieces, building pieces. These are building pieces. Uh, that goes in the build, that goes in the build, and that goes, apparently, uh, that also goes in the build. And I think my, uh, I just finished this sucker. So, yeah. All right, well, uh, let's, let's take that out of there, and then we can also start cooking copper, because we've got a lot of copper. All right, and then we'll put uh, all this stuff away. Now, <coughs> Uh, as far as... Oh, how's my health? Oh, man. I need to have you. I'm going to grab a couple of you, some of you. And... Let's check out the uh, situation. Oh, you're good. Oh, okay. Then I don't need that extra water. Ha-ha! Ha-ha-ha! Nice. But we will cook that. There we go. And we'll put these ones away. And we'll put that back. And... Oh, look at all the glass we have. I'm going to have to do something with that because uh, I quite I quite like the look of glass. And, uh, yeah. Now, to make glass panels, I think I need power and mass, if I remember correctly, which is pretty well... Yeah, see, I need power and mass. It's the materials. I've got the materials. It's the power and mass that I'm missing. And then to actually make, um, like, the glass walls and such, you need, like, adhesive and uh, the, the metal ingots. And then for metal ingots, I believe I am down to two. So yeah, there's a few things that I'm gonna have to be able, it's not just having enough glass fragments, although that's good to have for repairs. Uh, you have to have all the other pieces as well. Oh yeah, let's put that away there as well. But I think we're in good shape. The only thing is I should probably remember <laughs> to pick up my <laughs> lock pick. Uh, how many of you thought I was gonna forget my lock pick? Huh? Probably a whole lot, because I do have a habit of, you know, forgetting my mock thing. All right, let's just top this up with uh, wood. Yeah, that should be good. And now, whoa, that was that was basically not what I wanted to do. But oh, hey, got some uh, got some uh, kelp out of that. So that's actually kind of awesome. Yeah, I guess no one's coming to visit. Is it going to be one of those quiet days? Is that what we're, is that where we're happening? Happening? What's happening today? I don't know. All right. Um, oh, let's have the bacon and eggs. Oh, that's perfect. And then we could have ourselves, you know, a little variety of vegetables. And then I think we're pretty well. What is that sound?
sounds really it sounds like marbles is it just me maybe it's just me <laughs> all right well i think we got to figure out what we're going to do i was oh there's a hunter right there he's just wandering around yeah he's not he's not coming over to visit i don't think hmm. well yeah i'm not i don't really know what, whether i want to get started on something i think i think i'm just going to have to do some looting today um I just get the feeling that, like, it's been a while, I think, since somebody's come to visit. Hmm. All right. I think we need to do some looting. Okay. So we've got ourselves all sorted out. Uh, blah, blah, blah. We've got uh, pistol rounds. We've got a lock pick and all that kind of stuff. So I think that's what we're going to do. We're just going to head out and, uh, and do some... Nobody's coming? Ooh. I saw fiber over there. Yeah, it was kind of a different sound. It was this sort of a... Tick, 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 tick. Not really sure what that was all about. Is I don't know if that's my computer, if that's me, or if that's the, if that's the game. Yeah. See, nobody's coming. All right. Well, I'm not looking that a gift horse in the mouth. Yeah, I'm going to hear probably... Oh, my God. All right. Come here. You know, it, have to, it has to happen sometimes. Nobody's coming? Okay. So let's pick up this bad boy and then we're going to head on out. Although what I should do is, yeah, let's just jam this into the fridge. Otherwise it's going to rot potentially. If I'm going to go out for the day, then I don't want wolf meat going bad in my, uh, my thingamabobber. Okay, let's just put you in there. All right, let's head on out. Oh, now I've got a bear. What is going on here? Why Why is that, that part? I, I get the feeling the animals are trying to prevent me from going in that direction. Do you think it's possible? Yeah, see, he's like right on the beach. All right, well, we'll go up around him. Is that what you want, Mr. Bear? Is that is that the... Is it because you know there's hunters coming down the hill? and Oh. Or is it because you know there's like a bunch of ammo crates up there and you want me to go get them? Because, you know... Bears like it when I have, like, I'm fully loaded with ammo. Oh, look at that. Okay. All right. Well, let's just do it. <laughs> so, yeah, today, wow. Oh, an SVT round and a 44 round. Ooh. Night and a shotgun and another. Oh, my goodness. That bear, I don't know if he knew what he was getting himself into. <clears throat> so. Oh, I'm awful close to uh, Alpha. Ugh. I should probably be careful. Where is he? Uh, I'm just gonna. Ooh, hey. Let's get you. Do do do. Now that's the other thing that I have to really start getting back into is getting ores. Uh, I am really low on iron, and uh, yeah, so definitely have to go and get that. So yeah, <laughs> so I think definitely uh, a loot day is in order, and we're just gonna get out of here because I'm. I was just a little bit too close to the. Uh, to the hunters. I wonder if they're going to get take exception to me being that close and then I'm going to be seeing them later on today. Maybe. It's possible. I think that happens quite often. I think I'm far enough away and they decide that that's not necessarily true. <laughs> so well, let's not worry about it. Okay, let's grab you and you. Okay. Now I am trying to let leave the hunters alone a little bit. Um, mostly because, uh, I don't know if you've noticed this in our, uh, co-op game, but, uh, it, <laughs> oh, hello, wolf. Uh, the problem with the co-op game is that I think we, we hit up those hunters pretty frequently. Um, <laughs> some of them, I think we hit up pretty well almost every day. Uh, okay. I thought I heard something, but. No, I guess not. Uh, we hit them up. We hit them up almost every day, and I think that the problem is doing that. Uh, it doesn't allow them to build up their their stuff. Hey, chicken, how's it going there? Oh, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna get you, chicken. I got. I got meat and feathers like you wouldn't believe. I'm. I'm in great shape. Oh, there. I knew I was missing something. Let's get you. 
And we got to keep an eye out for iron and stuff. So yeah, let's just keep uh, moving on. We got another crate over here. Ooh, ooh. Oh, so anyways, yes. Um, uh, the the Christmas special episode. <laughs> I had fun recording that actually. I really missed that base. That that was actually a really cool base. You can actually, in some ways, you can sort of spot the the similarities between my current builds and. And that build because um, I, I I like that concept uh, quite a bit. The uh, uh, basically a, a, a sort of an inner core surrounded by foundations and and with defensible positions. I've switched over to doing more full walls instead of railings on the outside, uh, mostly because the railings they do leave you kind of exposed. And of course, uh, the most I exciting part of that whole thing was that. Uh, was uh, giving away some keys that Cold Games had provided. So uh, that was uh, Edwin and Phil. They they actually won. Um, very nice because, uh, uh, you know, th it's always nice to, that uh, I think uh, Cold Games, he, he, the way he put it when he gave the keys to me was, uh, you know, uh, I really like your stuff and basically, and, and I think you, you do uh, a lot of good work for subsistence and people come, you know, come to, come to me and uh, they and all of that and I think that it would be great if we could reward your your uh, your viewers and so I'm like hell yeah <laughs> I think that's awesome so I was quite happy about that now there uh, the reason why I'm bringing this up is number is two reasons the first is just to say once again congratulations to uh, Phil and Edwin hey there mr. wolf okay that's fine let's just we'll go around you and the second reason is because I have one more key and so I will be doing another uh, another uh, uh, event. Um, man, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm distracted because I've got bears and wolves all around me. Uh, I will be doing another event for New Year's. So a celebration of the New Year. Someone's going to get uh, someone is going to get a subsistence key. So we'll we'll that'll be though. I think um, I'm going to shoot for the 31st for that episode. And then it'll be the same basic format, uh, you know. We'll have a keyword in the in a, in a comment, and oh, there it is. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted right there. Um, and of course, the, the the whole keyword thing is. I mean, I could just simply say leave a comment, but then not everybody actually wants a key. Some people they already have it, and they they don't mind leaving you know op opportunities for others. And so, yeah. Anyways, all right, enough of that. Um, we have a uh, subsistence scene to get back to. And I think we have another. Now, I, I am concerned about rogues because I do believe we ran into rogues over here previously. Oh, man, my, uh, I mean, we're doing pretty good, actually. Um, we did run into rogues previously, and I don't know... And I am kind of just sort of running willy-nilly here. Uh, avoiding the animals, of course, but... Like that bear. Who's gone up in his hind legs, because he's like... Hey! I know you. You're that hunter guy. Yeah. Um... Oh! There's some rogues right there. Oh, look at that! One, two, three! Oh... Yeah, I don't think I want to go after them. Hmm. What, what's down there? Oh, it's a wolf. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I want to go after them. I think uh, I think I'm going to stay up away, and uh, but I am going to sort of go along the top and see if I can skirt around them a little bit, and uh, you know, work my way. Now I do have to. Oh, did you see that? Oh, that was. That blueberry despawned right in front of me. And, of course, now, here's the one problem. Uh, right now, oh, okay, so it is noon. It's, uh, the problem is that when the, when the, when it gets a little kind of overcast like this, it gets hard to tell what time of the day it is. Uh, don't, I'm, don't mind, I'm just running in the distance. Think, I'm like a deer. I'm like a, uh, think, th I th when you see me, imagine antlers, Mr. Hunters. That's that's me. I've got antlers on, and I'm just frolic. Oh, that's not actually good. They might want to come and shoot me just for my antlers so they can make glue. Yeah, I don't think they're bothered by me. But that wolf might be. 
Yeah, I hear you. I hear you, Wolf. I I hear you. So I'm gonna basically uh, just check out Ortastic. Uh, now this does tend to be a bit of a hotbed for um, well rogues, but also uh, like bears and wolves and such. So oh, but it is worth it because uh, it does I find have a lot of ores. So. Uh, not well, not the exact order we want, although zinc is not unwelcome. But we're ho I'm hoping that there's going to be some others on this. Uh. So this is, this is kind of nice. This is like a long, long... Uh, uh. Oh, man, but Ortastic's not delivering. Oh. Ortastic. How could, how could you do this to me? I think it's upset. Yep. Ortastic's upset because I haven't been here for so long. Oh boy. But, you know, we had to visit Ortastic just just uh for the for the kicks and giggles. So that's kind of cool. Here we'll add that to our scrapbook. <laughs> nice. Actually, you know what? Oh, I love these views. Here, let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay. So, I think what we're going to have to do though is uh we're going to have to head back uh, as I say, it is noon-ish. Now it's a little afternoon, and so it's going to take me probably just as long to get back as it took me to get here. And on top of that, well, I could run into trouble, actually, in which case I would end up being delayed. Um, apparently there's some excitement. Maybe I can... Oh! Can't get that. Oh! terrible all right let's just sneak on past hopefully now the problem is when they go after animals like that sometimes they run and chase them and if they run it ran and chase those animals over here ugh, that might be bad for me so let's just keep moving uh now i the reason why i ate just now is uh i'm trying to make sure yeah see how close they are over here there's four of them oh that would be bad <clears throat> I might be able to handle two or three if I was, like, kind of lucky and I had some good terrain and I planned it out a little bit. But four, that's where that's where things start to go a little sideways. So. Okay. Let's just keep going. Um, Got to check for iron. I don't think I can get you. You're kind of a little up top. Now, I did already hit this one up, but sometimes they respawn during... Day. Okay, moving on. We'll check out this rock over here as well. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, so I, I did want to make sure that I could keep my stamina up so that... Uh, just a chicken? All right. Uh, if I did end up having to get chased and run all the way back to my base, I'd actually have a snowball's chance and, well, you know. <laughs> no. Nope, no oars. Okay. How about... Ooh, scrap, though. That's kind of welcome. And you. There's my base. I'm not too far away. That's actually a lot closer than it feels, isn't it? Hmm. I guess I should have gone a little further past Ortastic. Maybe I could have gone into the valley. <gasps> now, copper's not unwelcome. So, am I going to be able to get up there? Yes. Okay, I'll just get you. Yeah, I think right here actually was where those rogues were. So they've obviously moved on. Um, oh, there's a building crate. And... Nope, nope. Wolf, you didn't see me. I think he's... I think I... I think he's fine. Do, do, do. Oh, what's... Is Mr. Uh, Alf? Or that's uh, Charlie. What's he doing? Oh, he's just hanging out. Okay. All right, we're good. Now, there's often... Oh, yeah, see, he's he's wandering over here. I think he was kind of interested. Now, the crates often come in threes, so I can't find the third crate. That's fine. I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, but we are going to hit up... Tr just check these rocks again. Because I, I need the iron. Uh, we'll check that one in a minute. Let's check the front face of this. 
Aha! That's a good thing I did, hey? <laughs> Can I? Okay. No, it's click, jump. Click, jump. There we go. And then there's you. Ah, we can reach this one, so that's good. And boom. All right. So we're not really doing that great on iron. We got 11, which is not terrible. But I, I definitely would like more. And I, I'd love to go up to Ortasta. Or actually, the uh, new location is Ormazing. Oh, hello, bear. Um, okay, we're good. Is Ormazing. But Ormazing has uh, alphas like right next to it. Is there anything up here? Aha! Good thing I checked. Do, 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 do. And, all right. Let's move along. Maybe this one. Got any ores on here? Got a bear and a wolf. Sneak past. Oh, no. He sort of saw me. Oh, no, he's fine, though. That was just the, uh, the initial... Uh, hey, bud, I know you're there. And then he doesn't actually run. Oh, man. All right. Let's make sure we got a full... Where are they? Um... Two, two, two. Hey, wolf! <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> I don't know if that worked. I I don't think I needed to do that. Oh, it's my stamina that's low. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Got to get my stamina back. Okay, my med kits are all good. Oh, they ran. Oh, you jerks. Ah. <sighs> well, you know what? I'll tell you something. I didn't I didn't really lose a lot of ammo. I did m fire off a few rounds, which... Uh, let's reload while we're still here. I did fire off a few rounds and uh, all of that sort of stuff. I was really hoping that they, they'd get engaged the bear and the wolf. That was the plan, at least. That's why I pulled them over like that. And the fact that they didn't is kind of disappointing, to be honest with you. Now... What's going on? Okay, you guys m mind your own business. Now, what's going on? Was that Alpha? Or Charlie, I mean? Because uh, that's one of them, isn't it? And there's a bear right there. What's going to happen with that bear? They're ignoring each other. Well, that's not right. Oh. So the question is, uh, who was that? I, th I think it was... Uh, I think it was uh, these guys right here. This guy. Oh, that was a nice shot. Oh. Now he's got his SVT out. Okay. <laughs> that was actually kind of cool. That was a... Uh, here, actually, let's bring you... Okay. Actually, it's you that should be reloaded. All right. Well, that was um, that was not bad. I actually quite enjoyed that. That's a very slow motion uh, engagement there. <laughs> With some 
I would say extremely lucky shots. Now, what we don't know is, um, was that actually, uh, was it actually the Charlie base that came over to attack me? I don't think it was. I think it was uh, the Bravo base, and I think it, we just happened to see Charlie. Oh, I've got a lot of inventory on me. I should probably not have engaged them like that. Uh, but I am going to come over here and I'm going to get that crate, even though uh, that's probably a danger. Because there was, there's two of them. There were two people, and only uh, oh, there's there's another guy right there. Oh, he's coming for me. Oh, I almost died. Okay. All right. That's good. Oh! Somebody died. Did they die from a bear? Oh, cool. Okay, so that was three. I think it might actually have been. Oh, man, my health is really bad. Okay, let's, we'll have to use a health kit. Uh, let's go check out their base. Um, it, whoa! Oh, it's inside. It's inside. Okay. I think there's... Hey guys. <laughs> that is so disconcerting. <laughs> Checking out Charlie's base. <laughs> oh. Oh man. That is so cool. Oh, you can hear them in there. They're just getting all antsy. <laughs> oh, all right. I'm not pushing my luck anymore because they could come out that... I don't know what the algorithm is. I don't know what it states as far as when they choose to come out and when they don't. Hey, I got 17 iron. That's pretty good. So, oh, is that a level one? Now, sometimes if you're super lucky with a bow, you can, ah, uh, no, you can get a headshot. He's <laughs> still lying there. <laughs> you can get a headshot. It's not worth going after him, by the way. He's t they're too quick. The best way to go after them is with an SVT. Ah, no more, no more ores. Okay. And we're running out of light. So I think we're just going to have to head back to the base uh, and call that an interesting uh, loot and etc. day. So all kinds of stuff. That was actually kind of fun. I, had, I enjoyed that. <laughs> but, uh, oh, Charlie. Oh, did you hear that? It's like you're, you're sort of hanging around outside. The, all you can hear is the cocking guns. And, uh, and you're like, oh, are they going to come out and get me? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, boy. Oh, man. Okay. And is that still running? Yes. And we've got enough here. Let's, uh, let's grab you. And we're going to make a couple of fuel bricks like that. And then see what else. I'm going to have to make some uh, health kits because I am definitely low on health kits. We can put you away. And oh, let's put the uh, SVT rounds away. Um... Where are they? There we go. So we're definitely at the point where we could switch over to the SVT soon. We still have a number of 44 rounds, so we're in good shape there. Uh, in fact, I could probably s probably just keep uh, here. There we go. Uh, three reloads, one plus three reloads. So that'll be good for the uh, for the uh, shotgun shells. And we are building our uh, 44 rounds or nine mil rounds back up again. So that's actually kind of nice to see as well. Hey, let's get some light going. There we go. And, uh, where did I get a foundation from? Was that from a hunter? <laughs> I got a foundation from a Oh, that's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> Let's put that there. Uh, actually, and then what we'll do is we'll, uh, we'll work on the iron a little bit because uh, iron is kind of, I don't know, I think it's what we mostly use. Okay, that's weapons, weapons, weapons. Uh, and that's an ore, which can go in here. And do we have any other ores? No. Okay. And that, but uh, actually, let's see. This can go in there. And cloth, biofuel. In fact, here, let's just do this. 
just because we are running the uh, whatchamacallit and we'll put one of those in there and then we'll take the other fuel brick and put it right in here like that all right and put you away and then what have we got we've got you and you and you boards seeds uh, you go with the okay there we go that goes in there so no lock crate today that was kind of a bummer um, a little disappointing actually but you know what are you gonna do uh, I think there's just less of them in this area than there used to be that seems to be what people generally are saying that's the consensus um, so you know it's what I'm seeing as well and it, it kind of uh, it kind of makes sense uh, you gotta encourage people I think it's to encourage people to go the other half of the map that's that's my best guess okay let's grab you 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 and you and we gotta take care of the plants um, there we go. Uh-oh. Did you hear that? <laughs> what the? <laughs> they're not attacking my base. What the? What's going on? And oh, they're, uh, they are attacking my base. Where are they? Oh, right there. Wait a minute, how's he standing up? Where... Where is he? Now, was he fishing and then he saw me and then came over to attack me? But I don't see him anymore. He's... Is he drowning? Oh, now I'm definitely not going to hear him. Oh, there he is! Where are you going? There we go. Uh, hopefully there's not more than one. Otherwise, I am dead. Uh, that was kind of interesting. Um, you know what? Let's see if we can... It's too dark. I can't see anything. All right. Let's head back. Okay. Well, that was kind of interesting. I wonder if that was uh, one. Uh, yeah, I think. Okay, my best guess is that he heard me. He was uh, he ca he came down from Alpha to do some fishing. Uh, he heard me and decided to attack when I when he saw me. So, uh, and then of course you know the rest is history. So, come on, up you come. There you go. Man, we haven't had trouble getting out of water for a while. That's kind of a disappointment. Um, all right, I need to do some repairs, obviously. Well, that's on the books for the next episode, that's for sure. Ha <laughs> uh, ha! But you... Oh, hey. I got another fuel brick. Nice! Oh, that's awesome. Thank you, Hunter. I much, That's much appreciated. Uh, let's see. We've got a full set of here and there. And... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The one thing I think I will do is... Uh, let's get you and... Oh, we're, oh, biofuel. Yeah, I need biofuel for the... Uh, 50. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And let's grab you and you in there. Uh, and then I need cloth. And then we can make some health kits. Uh, let's make five. And maybe some bandages as well. There we go. And that's good. All right. And nice. So we're doing pretty good on the medicinal tonic. So that's actually kind of good to see. There we go. We'll put that there. All right. I think this is a good place to stop. The weather is going to start getting kind of crappy, which uh, which is nice for the uh, for the windmill. Yeah. See, it's a uh, yep. Point zero five power even at night. That's awesome, and uh, so that'll help out quite a bit. And it is early morning, so I guess definitely <laughs> we should probably call it. Let's just head upstairs and and see if there's any last minute rogue sign I don't see any okay I think we're good
All right, I think this is a good place to stop, so I'm going to call it here. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. That was kind of an interesting one, actually. We we got to got to take a look at Charlie. That was that was nice, and or tastic. That was nice too. All right, bye bye. <laughs>